Well, hello and welcome to Glen ZB TV for Tuesday, the show that puts Glen ZB up your periscope. I'm bringing New Zealand to the world and the world to New Zealand. And it's the big birthday episode today. Not the birthday of Glen ZB TV, just my, my birthday. It's not really a, a big birthday. It's just another birthday. Thanks for... Um, all the bourbon and stuff that you've seen in. I mean, I haven't got it yet, but I'm sure it's it's on the way, right? Anyway, enough about me. And back to our building and the way that it's dying just before we move to our new building. Uh, we're nearly, nearly there. Uh, just a week and a half to go. Uh, but it's dying fast now. It's things. Are, this, this building is really slipping away. I arrived at work this morning to discover. I don't know if that's really going to come out on the video, but there's a mop. You can clearly see the mop there. Uh, different levels of moisture, and then a big puddle that's spread out over the carpet and gone. And it's quite squidgy. Like it wasn't just. It didn't just look like it was wet. When you stepped on it, it, it went that sort of thing going on there. Uh, there was a lot of signage around. Um, which one shall I put up first? This is the sign on the dishwasher. It says, uh, please use back kitchen dishwasher. This one is flooding. This is flooding, this one here. So, you know, flash that we've got dishwashers all over the place. Not so flash that one... Seems to be intent on drowning us all in our own building. Another sign above the sink. Sink blocked. Uh, please avoid using. Get, 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 get us out of here. Please. Can we not, can, I, I asked somebody the other day if we could move sooner. They said we could. We just wouldn't be on air if we did that, so... I guess that's a slight issue given that it's a radio station and we have to do radio shows. Now, this whole COP21 thing. COP21. It's not quite the same ring, is it? COP21. Because uh, remember, uh, when we first heard about climate change conferences, they were called Kyoto. They were all called Kyoto. As far as I was aware, there's only ever been Kyoto. Was Darfur one or was that, was that something else? I don't know. But... It's always been Kyoto. It's always been about Kyoto. They had a nice catchy ring. We like Kyoto. It's a bit like Tokyo, but with the different letters around the... COP21? What's that? A conference of parties, apparently, is... And then, and then it's the 21st... It's not... They need a better name. Hot Air Conference, I think, is what we'd like to call it. And it, uh, John Key, uh, who's at the Hot Air Conference with his own contribution to the hot air conference today i was a little bit again i was suffering from a little bit of what it, i call that sort of key cringe when he opens his mouth and he puts an h into strong for example or stronger making it strong and stronger uh we've talked about at least the fact that he thinks uh more than one text is a collection of texters which is incorrect, of course. Um, and then today he was talking about carbon subsidies, but he kept leaving out some of the letters. Interesting that he'll add a syllable onto texts and make it texters, but with subsidies, he'll leave out the middle of the word subsidies and just call them subsidies. Go back and listen. I think you'll be slightly ashamed on behalf of the rest of the country. That... Uh, was the big birthday edition of Glare ZB TV. Thank you so much for having me. Uh, up your periscope. And I'll just go down to the mailroom and wait for the bourbon to come in. And I'll see you tomorrow.